Baltimore Orioles hosting the Boston Red Sox. The Red Sox are minus 112 on the money line. The Orioles are plus 102. The over-under is nine runs. Boston laying a run and a half or plus 135, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two. The Orioles getting a run and a half or minus 155, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Pavetta has pitched twice against the Orioles this year. Four and a third, three runs, three earned. They lost that game 9-5 to five in Baltimore. Six innings, one run, one earned. They won that game 12-2 to two in Boston. Kremer has pitched once against the Red Sox. It was in Boston. Five and two thirds, four runs, four earned. They lost that game four to three. The Red Sox are on a one game winning streak. They're six and four in their last 10. They are 31 and 31 on the road. They are 61 and 60 on the run line. So they're one game over 500 if you've been betting them that way. They've lost Pavetta's last three starts. They're 11 and 12 with him on the mound. The over is hit in his last three games, and the over is 14 7 and 2 in the games in which he pitches in. The Orioles are on a one game losing streak. They're 4 and 6 in their last 10. They are 34 and 23 at home. They're a much better home team than they are on the road. They are 78 and 42 on the run line. They are the best team in baseball if you bet them getting or laying runs. They are 36 games over 500. They are 8 and 5 as a team with Kremer on the mound. The under is hit in his last three games, and the under is 9 and 4. The Red Sox won their last meeting. Baltimore is 6-4 and four against them in their last 10. The home team is 6-4. and four. The underdog getting a run and a half is 8-2. and two. The Orioles have been an underdog in almost all of these games. The, there have been three one-run games in their last 10 meetings. The under is 5-4-1 and one in their last 10. And the over-under 9 is 5-5. Five and five. I'm taking Baltimore with the money line, Baltimore with the runs. And I'm going over because when Pavetta is on the mound, these games go over. And when the last time they played in Baltimore, the game went over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.